After our tour at the stilted village called Kampung Pluk, we ate a nice lunch, ordered coffee to go, and headed to what arguably is the most charming temple in Cambodia. Hi. Hello. So we just ordered our coffee. I have brown coffee. It's here. And we're about to go out, but wanted to show you the place. It's actually a very good place to have a study. Just have coffee with bread. The ambiance is good, it's very well lighted. And the place is covered with high glass walls. This is their outdoor seating. It's actually a good place to hang out. But we're about to go to another temple, so we need to go. Yes. We will unbox <laughs> <laughs> the, the coffee and the cookies that Walter ordered from Brown Coffee. Oh, that's mine. And this is. um. My frappuccino, they call it brown frapp, and it's one of the signature coffee that they have. Meanwhile, I'm going to drink hot coffee. If you can see, I need the, help. If you, if you if you can see the weather outside, it's very really hot. I don't think I can drink this now. I'll probably drink this in a while. So I'll give Fia one cookie. Yes, because I am disappointed. <laughs> yeah, she needs her sugar. <laughs> you can see it's raining. So. Mr. Nee brings the rain. <laughs> the first time we met him, it rained. The second time we met him, it rained. The past days without him, it's very sunny. Sunny, yes. We've reached um, Bantai Shrey, and it's 4.23 in the afternoon. So they close at um, 5.30 p.m. We thought it was already closed because that sign was put in front of the um, ticket, uh, ticket check, check checkpoint. Point. Yeah. This temple is not so busy compared to Angkor Wat and Bayon and the others that we visited um, because it's very quite far from the city center. That's right. This is one of the less visited temples, but um, a lot of tourists that come here also like it because it's charming and it's unique. So this temple was built for the ladies. So that's why it's called Lady's Temple. Bantai Shre is a 10th century Cambodian temple dedicated to the Hindu god Shiva. Bantai Shre is built largely of red sandstone, a medium that lends itself to the elaborate decorative wall carvings which are still observable today. The buildings themselves are miniature in scale, unusually so when measured by the standards of Angkorian construction. These factors have made the temple extremely popular with tourists and have led to its being wildly praised as a precious gem or the jewel of Khmer art. Bantai Shre is the only major temple at Angkor not built by a monarch. What can you say about this temple, Fia? Um, it's different. If you will see how uh, the stones are, they're reddish, probably made from, I don't know, partly clay. Or because the soil here we've noticed is redder compared to the other parts of the city. Mm -hmm. um, the temple feels there's that sense of femininity, probably because it's redder or has that color. And you will see that in the videos later. And that's why probably they called it Lady's Temple, but we'll read more about it so we can share it with you. Baba O? Yeah. Oh. So the doors are ah oh no, but it has because uh, this wooden plank. But platform. then again, even with the, without the wooden plank, it would just be as tall as I am. That's right. That's right. And I'm short, by the way. I'm only five two. See, ah, uh, it's the first time I'm gonna hit my head in the doorway. <laughs> <laughs> no, even without the. Oh yeah, even from the f ground. It's just the door is short. Bantai Shrey is known for the intricacy of its carvings. The sandstone used for such elaborate carvings had to be of extraordinary quality. Indeed, the red sandstone is a hallmark of the style of Bantai Shrey, never used in other Angkor styles. Its hardness is the reason too why even after one millennium, 
the Bantai Shrey carvings are the best preserved examples of Angkorian relief art, almost unchanged as scarcely anything is weathered. It has been speculated that the temple's modern name, Bantai Shrey, is due to the many devatas carved into the red sandstone walls. The name means Citadel of the Women or Citadel of Beauty and is probably related to the intricacy of the bas-relief carvings found on the walls and the tiny dimensions of the buildings themselves. Some have speculated that it relates to the many devatas carved into the walls of the buildings. So we're here, I think, in the innermost um, area of the temple. And you can see... Ganda. Actually, the, the carvings on the wall are very... The carvings on the walls are very intricate. intricate. So you can see Bantai Shre in the background. And it's a small temple. You can finish it in less than 15 years, maybe. Mm -hmm. If you want to admire all the carvings, and there are old Sanskrit or uh, characters on the wall. Yeah. We are walking back to the parking area, and this is the last temple that we're gonna visit in Siem Reap this um, for this trip. Alright, we have a stop over at um, Prayer Roop, which is an old temple as well. And our tuk tuk driver said that before the pandemic, this used to be one of the sunset spots because you can also see the nice sunset from this temple. Actually, if you move a little from here, I don't know if you can see it from the camera, you can actually see a high staircase towards one of the highest towers. Yeah. So I think that's where you can see the sunset. Yes. But now it's already closed and our tuk-tuk driver said that um, they move all of the sunset viewing um, in the other temple um, to control COVID, COVID spread, I guess. Um, so we don't know whether they will open this again for sunset viewing or not. It's 6.30 in the evening and we're now walking along Pub Street. So, so we're just going to explore and see what we can find here. Yes, that's right. It's livelier than expected. I thought, you know, there's not a lot of people. But of course, this is, um, I don't know, compared to pre-pandemic, it's kind of quiet. Yeah, so I'm not sure time. if people, uh, because I haven't been here, so people come here Maybe later. later. Maybe they're still at the spa, like, to re, uh, sorry, <laughs> relaxing. Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. Hey. So there are a lot of restaurants, the Red Piano, a lot of bars. And Do you remember the restaurant you ate? Actually, I With don't. With your family? Ah, I think this one, Temple Club. Was it this one? This one sounds familiar. <laughs> the video of it. All right, that's Mantai um, Shrey. Oh, Fia. Teka lang. <laughs> Salamat ah. Wala na nagbi-video ako. Ano na gawin ko? Okay, magbi-video daw siya. Ano yan? Anong ganap? Wait, yun. Ano na naglalakad? Wala. Ayun ang sound ko. Ouchie. 
Wait. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I caught it on video. Sunki. 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 I'm sorry. Hold it. Sunki. Sunki. Tata, wake up. I'm trying to, but my eyes won't open. 